He tried to downplay it, but um, you could see it. You could see it when he was talking to us that this game means an awful lot to him. Yeah, the body language uh, certainly stood out as TK Wilkerson goes thundering forward. He had nine carries in the opening game. I, I don't know if you can be beleaguered after two games, but Josh Heupel looked beleaguered about the pre-snap penalties. We were talking to him about it as Gabriel's got a quick snap here. The lefty from the islands goes for the end zone and got it. Touchdown. He, he's six foot five and Gabriel just puts the ball up to give him a chance. He is in the ball game for the first time. A very interesting senior tailback who we'll tell you about throughout the course of this telecast as Smith goes deep down the left side and it is intercepted. Richie Grant is on it. He's at seven the past two years and his second already this year. Even Collins is a linebacker who puts a lot of pressure on. Look at that press coverage on the bottom. I know you love seeing that. Oh, my goodness. That thread through is intercepted. Picked off by Tulsa off the deflection. And the Golden Hurricane gets a pick for Zaven Collins. Literally on the run that time. Collins nearly lassoed him for a sack. As Stokes will return the punt from Osteen. And he waves it off as the ball tries to find him, and it's inside the two down to the one. It's tougher for defensive backs to track receivers. You can't play on the edge of your feet. Big hit in the backfield, and that's a safety if it stands. There is a flag down. Eric Gilliard popped Smith. You know, totally focused, a guy who really grinds. He really, really works at his craft. Anderson. Oh! It's a dance party. Otis Anderson cuts it again and scores. What wow. an effort. Soft shoe from Anderson. Watch him as he gets through here. Runs through a tackle. Nice move. And then the nice vision here to see that he needs to get back to the outside. But his balance when he came through the middle there, unbelievable. It's a heck of a run. We saw the Memphis SMU game go down to the wire earlier just before our telecast as Smith on a third down and five oh. gets battered. Oh, oh did oh. he get absolutely hammered? Oh, my goodness. Wow. Right now, the Big 12 is looking like they have no interest in getting into the playoff, which would help UCF. First down run for the AM transfer Prince, and Prince goes carving across the 40 yard line. It's a first down for Tulsa. Any other area? Three awesome quarterbacks in Florida right now. And don't forget the Seminoles beat Jacksonville State today as there is another safety. Wow. He may not get back down here, though. Long's kick, tough angle is good. It's not bad for recruiting when you can say we go fast and throw the ball a lot. Yep. Gabriel sideline ball and got it. There is Flash Robinson, the Oklahoma transfer. You know how fast you have to be to be called Flash? A little <laughs> double move on Evans. And Evans was victimized. Attendance allowed for this game? Yeah, and masks required. Danny White, the athletic director, did a video showing it as Gabriel uncorks down the sideline. Got Robinson again inside the 35. And you're going to see the short box as Gabriel steps up. Gabriel scramble mode. Dylan Gabriel into open space inside the 15 and a first down. I'd go Anderson. Big backfield. They go straight ahead into the pile. And touchdown. It is the left guard typically, Cole Schneider. He's got a story for a lifetime now. <laughs> a little... Ode to Refrigerator Perry back in the day. Give the big lineman the football on the goal line and let him knock people out of the way at 300. Smith on first down. Up in the pocket. Smith unloads. Middle of the field. Got it. Touchdown. Beautiful ball to Johnson. And Tulsa's on the board under a minute in the first. Finding his rhythm. Getting in a groove. He climbs the pocket, holds on, feels this, and we talked about the arm strength. He showed you that on three straight plays. Watch his route here by Josh Johnson. We talked about UCF speed. 
little nod to the outside and then just get vertical is probably why he changed the play. There he goes. Smith down the middle. On target touchdown. Sam Crawford Jr. One play at home for Tulsa. How about that? Talked about taking a shot. Here's your shot. You run a, a penalties on him, but we've seen a couple on lead tonight. First and 15, Gabriel is hit, and he is sacked. Penetration Coverage. with just a couple of rushers. Good low. The key thing to do is to use the hand down low. Yeah, he, he made it too open and obvious. Anderson carving across the 30 and dropped out of bounds by Reeves, but Otis Anderson getting an untracked run. Obarski, the kick. He sailed one wide last time. This one is true. And so Tulsa took that field goal early. I'm off the clock and allow the defense to rest. Second and ten. Smith had to hustle it a little bit. He's got an open man. It's Stokes. And a big hitter for Zach Smith. Again, right on the button. Passes or keep running it here. Smith. On a crossing route, got it to Crawford, and Crawford's inside the five. Full house. Two plays. They got two plays to get it. They run it. They don't need it. Wilkerson backs in, and touchdown Tulsa. An awful lot. They had a lot of success against UCF last, last season. And down on this goal line, you knew they were going to go behind them and count on them to push, push, push it in, whether it took one play. Right now, Tulsa has all the momentum. This was 23 to 5, UCF, largest deficit, 18, as Stokes breaks out of it. Stokes to the sideline. Does he have enough room on the perimeter? Yes, he does. Oh, what a tight roll back to the 40-yard line. Not good enough to pick it up. You can't throw for it. You just tried twice in a row. Lachlan Wilson sends it toward the five, and it's down right there. Stokes back to receive. He gets hit. He lost his helmet. They got to blow this thing dead. Stokes goes down. His helmet ends up at the 12-yard line or so, and they're going to throw a flag for tossing his helmet. Kevin's an Ithaca alum, and so was Rod Serling, and this feels like the twilight zone tonight. Big dash run for Wilkerson across the 40-yard line after a nine-yard first quarter. Four-man rush with a twist. Down the middle. Touchdown, Tulsa. First lead. Stokes got it. Golden Hurricane with the advantage. Health has been very, Smith has been very comfortable. Look at this. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. And a heck of a throw back of the end zone. Also knocked down a ball. He was the tackle for loss leader in the country coming in after just one game. And this one ends up in the end zone. Should have been. Taylor on the run. Corey Taylor gets somersaulted down, and oh my goodness, do we have another injury. You know, you have a chance to pin him back. Your defense is playing well. It's a sound decision. Lachlan Wilson, the punt. Williams back to receive. This one checks up. Will it stay out of the end zone? It looks like the answer is yes at the one-yard line. But ever since we've seen numerous penalties, that frustration has went down. But going off, brother. Taylor on the run. Taylor's got a first down, and Tulsa will get three more downs to run some clock. Three timeouts remaining for UCF. You would imagine that will start to wane on this play and beyond. This is a hard Whoa. run for a first down. Goodness, Wilkerson was a bowling ball. Zach Long. From the hash mark. It is up and Long sends it on through. Tulsa makes it 34-26 with 90 seconds to go. Give him a shot. Harris is at the bottom of the screen as Gabriel uncorks it. Gabriel, top side, end zone, incomplete. Tulsa 
breaks the second longest home win streak in the nation with a massive comeback from 18 down. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.